Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are playing with fans. I just tweeted out for you guys to uh, guess a number between 1 and 10. The number was 7, and Tone actually got it right here. So we're going to challenge him. We're going to go late game. We're going to have a blast with this. Um, let's pick a fun map. Let, you know, let's do this one. So we're going to confirm here. We're trying to go late game. We're just having a good time. I'm going to be doing this a lot more in the future whenever I'm just sitting at my desk and I want to play with you guys. I'll make sure that it's in the afternoon for those of you who are in school. Um, I'll tweet out, and you just got to be lucky enough to be on Twitter to see it whenever it comes up. Um, so we're going to go with Super Monkey over here, guys, and uh, let's go with the subs, of course. Let's go with Balloon Chipper and see what we can get as our bonus. I don't want that. I'll re-roll, and an, I guess an engineer's... Um, an engineer is fine to keep, so we'll go... Wait. Uh... I guess that'll hold him off. Yeah, let's go. Alright, so we're ready. We're gonna see how this works. I don't know how... This is gonna be bad. This is gonna... This is probably gonna be bad. I don't know how late we'll be able to go. Um, but it should be fun playing with Tone. We'll see what happens. Um, so hopefully... And guys, it... Hopefully, uh, he goes late game which is what I said when I tweeted I was like hashtag late game so uh, that's what we're going for here we are definitely going for late game I'm gonna go ahead and get air burst darts just to help out once he starts farming eco and um, hopefully he'll take it easy towards the beginning whenever you try and go late game with your friends it's always good to pay attention to their defense and uh, how well they're doing. We're gonna go ahead, we'll just get barbed darts right there as well. And now we're gonna start sending uh, some balloons over. You can see he's starting to send his. So hashtag late game on here, guys. Uh, this is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm, I'm really excited to play with you guys. I played with some people uh, the other day as well. Two of you guys I played with, and it was a lot of fun. Um, so <laughs> I've got balloon chippers and super monkey and engineer so i don't know how well this is going to work out but we're gonna see i'm gonna go ahead and start building some of the uh engineers up here we'll go ahead and get one engineer right here and uh continue uh getting some balloon eco going so tone has got two subs over there uh as of right now and dang it he's got the best side of the map for subs because I have to deal with this freaking trash can right here if I ever want to put anything in there, which is super annoying. Uh, come on, get in there, get in there, where, where, are you, where are you at? Why aren't you fitting? Right there, alright, so we'll get that guy in there as well. And uh, we'll get one radioactive sub as well down in here uh, in just a little bit to help out with the corner. We'll go ahead and make this one the radioactive one. I gotta get back to farming, it's already round four. He's got a dart monkey. I don't know why I didn't choose a cheaper tower than the super monkey um, because the freaking balloon chippers suck early game. They're good late game because they dominate uh, they dominate the uh, the Moabs and, and whatnot whenever they come out. But until then, it's just not good. Balloon chippers just aren't that good of a tower until late game. Uh, so we'll see how we go. And guys, the other day I was talking about the subs and I was like, yeah, they're good. They're not that good uh, late game. Their ability is good late game whenever you max it out, obviously, but just the damage that they do, I don't find as good as other towers. Um, so that's why I said that, just to, to clarify. I do love the sub. The sub, like I've said in a bunch of my videos, is one of my favorite towers in the entire game. Love the sub. Um, and uh, we're gonna go ahead, let's see, we're gonna go get advanced intel on this one. We are going, shoot, I don't have any camo, I don't have any camo detection, guys. I just realized that. Shoot! Oh no, we have no camo detection whatsoever. This could end up being really, really bad. Oh no, we don't have any camo detection. I've failed so hard with the with the lack of camo detection. I needed a ninja. Why did I not get a freaking ninja? I'm so dumb. All right, so we're just gonna have to keep on going over here. Even if I just gotten a dart monkey or something, like what the heck, Mo? What were you thinking? Clearly, I wasn't thinking. I was just excited that I was about to play uh, with a fan. So that's gonna be big. That is gonna be big time that we don't freaking have any camo detection so I'm gonna have to be really really careful with that we'll go ahead and get larger service area over here and uh, I might go ahead and get that trap as well save up for that start getting a little bit of oh no we'll have camo detection down here once we 
once we get the, the sub rolling on the left. So that'll be good. It'll just be a little bit late. That's the only problem is that the game sends the balloons from the top. Yeah, see, look, there it is. No camo detection whatsoever except for the foam right now. Um, so we're going to save up a little bit. It's already around 12. We've got 500 eco. That's not bad at all. We're going to keep on grinding it out for just a little bit, trying it up to like 700 or so. Take a quick drink of my Coke. And, um, and then we'll start upgrading some stuff. But we are going to need to, we'll go ahead and submerge them or upgrade that. And then we'll save up for this, um, this radioactive sub uh, in just a second as we go ahead and lower that down. Air bar starts, I'm not going to get since I'm about to submerge him. And that should help us out a lot. That should be pretty good for us to get that. Uh, you can see he's got engineers as well. He's got engineers, dark monkeys, and subs. Uh, both of his subs are upgraded fairly well right now. So we'll go ahead and submerge this guy, get him rolling over here, and then we're going to start working on our eco again because I'm going to need a little bit more of it. I am very worried for all the camo that can come out. Like, if I wasn't playing a fan right now, I'd probably, I would definitely be in a little bit of trouble because he would just be sending camo at this point to me and I would be, uh, I'd be in trouble. I would definitely be in a lot of trouble at this point in time. So, um, let's go ahead though and save up for this trap. That's going to be 3,500, which is a lot. Um, so, uh, we'll see what happens there. Also guys, whenever I do invite y'all to play, um, please don't spam me with invites after that because if you do, then I'm just going to, uh, get rid of the friend request because, it just shows up in videos like that one right there. That was a guy that I played with yesterday. Um, so yeah, if you do get invited, Tone, if you're watching this, obviously you are. I'll let you guys know if I can play with y'all or play with you during streams and stuff like that. But please be respectful and don't spam me after the fact. So we've got our subs. Um, I kind of want to get one more sub out here. Uh, we'll go ahead and fit it in right there. Uh oh, I'm gonna, what, no, 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 stop, stop, gosh. I hate whenever you can't touch on anything else on the screen when you're trying to place a tower. It, sometimes it's so freaking... Why can I not fit this in here right now? Alright, alright, stop it, subs. There we go, we'll put that one right there. Nice, shoot, I didn't even realize that I had that much uh, loot going on over there. We're going to put that on strong as well to pop all the leads that are going to be coming out. That's going to help us out. Come on, I told you guys to focus on strong, and you're not doing it. I need you to pop the lead. There they go. So they're popping the lead for me. Um, we're going to keep on sending it out, try and build up our eco a little bit. Round 19 right here. We're doing good. We're doing good. No problem whatsoever so far. Um, I might get one more engineer over here. I'm also going to need to get a super monkey soon, but uh, what do we want to do? do we, I kind of want to get the trap. Let's go ahead and save. We're going to save up for this balloon trap so we can start getting some more money um, because that's going to be big for us. It's going to be big to be able to uh, fill that trap up and get money from it. There's one more lead balloon in there. Now it's popped. So we're doing good. We're holding on. Keep on holding. Keep on holding, subs. Come on, you got it. <laughs> there we go. Balloon trap right there. Dope. Got that balloon trap rolling. And uh, I am a little bit... I don't know why I picked this as... Uh, I don't know why I picked these as my towers, guys. I'm genuinely confused as to why the heck I picked these as my towers because... I don't know. I don't. I can't really go late game with, with these. I, I mean, I guess the engineer can kind of go late game to a certain extent. We're going to go ahead and try and get up to a thousand eco right here. There we go. And balloon trap full again. Nice. Let's build one more engineer. Let's build him right up here. Um, and sentry gun faster, etc, etc. Go ahead. Go this way. And uh, oh, that's the one thing about having traps is having to click on them and always like it's something else to do to pay attention to uh, is clicking on traps. So sometimes in the heat of the battle, especially when they're like covered by Moabs and stuff, it's so freaking hard to even remember to do that. Alright, so I gotta get ready to click on it, click on it right there. And uh, shoot, that was a pretty good one. $628 for that bad boy. Let's go ahead and get another balloon trap up here. And then now we're gonna go ahead and start building a couple of, uh, of uh, balloon chippers as well. We're gonna go left first on this because we're about to see our first Moab come out. So we'll go ahead get these two. We'll go 3-2 at first. Uh, I, can I click on that? Nice. Alright, I clicked on that. I clicked on that trap up there. And uh, we're just gonna let this, we're gonna hold out. We're gonna save up our, many, our money because I want to get uh, the 4-2 balloon chipper initially because they absolutely crush uh, they absolutely crush Moabs whenever they come out. So let's go ahead and spam some eco right now, actually, because it's one of the slow levels. Um, whenever you see a slow level like this where nothing's getting by, spam your eco. Spam it, spam it, spam it. Make as much as you can uh, just to help out. 
Tone uh, is, I guess he's not sending any right now. He's saving up for something. I just spent all of mine, but we got it to 1,200. So that's going to be epic. That's going to make our money back super quick. Go ahead, click on this trap up here and click on this trap right there. Nice. Look at that. We're owning these traps. I love the traps so much. Oh, no. What is happening? Come on. Why? Oh, how? Wait. Why? Are, oh, yeah. Okay. I forgot that the sub was there. I was like, wait a second. Why are they shooting the camo? Uh, so there we go. We'll go ahead and get that wider tunnel over there and um, get... I kind of want one more engineer up here just because they're so beast and because they're going to help out with the camo. But we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a super monkey. Put him on strong. Have him help out a little bit. Where's that one trap? There was another trap. Wait, why are we... We're missing a trap right now. How are we missing a trap? Is it like off the screen? There it is. What the heck was that? That was so weird. We were completely missing a trap. So the one up top is filling up right now. Come on, fill up. There we go. Tap on that bad boy. And let's go ahead and upgrade the super monkey. We'll get super range and epic range from him as well. Go ahead and click on that other trap. Nice. Those traps are so clutch. I love the traps so much. Um, I'll go ahead and build a couple more subs though. Uh, just because I love them and they are freaking beast. So we'll go ahead and go right over here. One, two and put that on strong as well and then we're gonna keep we're gonna keep some of them on first for us just to help out uh, with the balloons to start getting by all right some of them are getting by we'll go ahead and use our uh, balloon energy right there and let's get why would this I know he fits there there we go I right, get that sub fitting right there one one two keep him on first he's gonna start doing work over there um, I'm actually going to get another uh, nice I can build a wood chipper right there Sweet. we're gonna go right on this wood chipper there we go and uh, we'll go ahead and get these two. We're going to save up for that 4,500 and uh, get that rolling. we got to put this one on strong, actually. There it is. And get this other one. We're going to upgrade this right. Oh, no. Dang it. <laughs> I clicked on the wrong thing. So he actually has camos going by because he hasn't submerged his sub. So, Tone, if you're watching, you got to submerge your sub. Otherwise, right now, you're just wasting money on it. So make sure you do submerge your sub because it's going to help you out significantly as you go on throughout the game. Let's go ahead and get another uh, engineer down here. Let's go and get another freaking trap because that's going to be beast for us. Um, he's got two super monkeys going down and we've still got a good amount of eco that's helping us out. Look at that. They are just crushing those moabs as they come around the corner. So freaking good to see that. Uh, do I want another trap or do we want to upgrade? Let's upgrade our... Um, we're going to save up and upgrade our super monkey a little bit round 29 so not really late game i don't know what i consider late game i would say anything past round 40 is like mid game or at least if you were to look at the stats to see uh how late games normally last because a lot of people rush early on generally i would say that 30 or something would be considered uh late game if you were to ask me and if you were to ask like or look at statistics and stuff oh crap we're about to run into a issue with uh all of, look at all these camo leads coming by that's not good at all we got to get rid of those we got to pop those camo leads there we go um so that means i need some more engineers out here i'm gonna get one more balloon trap and let's get some more engineers rolling i don't really i don't want to have to use engineers though i'd rather be using other towers that help out and do a lot more damage you know what i'm saying uh, let's go ahead and we're gonna have to use some uh, oh no nice we didn't have to use energy at all sweet let's get one more wood chipper up here and throw him on right so we're gonna go all the way right with this one and just keep him on first as he starts doing work for us and uh, fill up that one trap fill up this trap nice come on hold it off hold it off they're holding off for us good job let's get a couple more subs and um, then start working on our eco just a little bit more. Come on, sub. I saw you. I saw you just fit. I saw you just fit. Stop it. See, this is what I'm talking about. I can't do anything whenever they fill up like that, or whenever uh, things are coming. I can't do. I, I'm. Get, I'm just getting confused now. Oh my gosh! Look at all these. Look at all these traps that are full. Man, they're filling up fast. Goodness, that's making us so much money though. That's awesome. Uh, let's put this guy on strong as well. And there's another full trap. And let's go ahead. But, oh, come on. Dang it, I put it in the wrong spot because I was freaking out. All right, I got to sell that one. I can't have that happen. It's going to be better late game to be able to hold more uh, subs in there. So we'll go ahead, go right. Can we go full right? We almost can on it, which is going to be sick. Let's fill that up. Come on now, tell me I can fit one. I know I can fit a sub here. Stop being stupid. There we go. Not right there. All right, sweet. We're going right again on these. Um fill up those traps man we're making so much money from the engineer trap it's ridiculous it's so sick i'm gonna go ahead and just boost just to be safe there 
get both of these traps. How much do we have? We have almost enough. Um, I'm gonna keep working on eco right now because this is the time that I got to do it while my uh, wood chip, my balloon chippers are up there doing work. Uh, come on, come on, Tone. You gotta hold off here, buddy. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We're making so much right now. It's ridiculous. Yes. Super Monkey, let's upgrade you to Sun God. There we go. All right, so he's going up to Sun God. And then, oh no, Tone only made it to round 34. How long are we at? We're at 15 minutes. Let's go ahead and um, and try and play one more. We'll pick a different map. Tone, if you're watching, you got to submerge your sub, my dude, all right? Let's go ahead and jump into one more with him. Um, and again, guys, generally if it ends that early, we'll, we'll, we'll play a couple games together. Um, so I'll challenge him one more time, and we'll pick a different map. Yes, I love this map. So we're going to do this map. I'm going to bring the ninja this time because I need, uh, I need it. I need some of that camo detection. And we'll go ahead and get a sub. And for you guys, let's go ahead and use a farm, huh? How does that sound? Let's see if we can get a good, yes, that roll though, that clutch roll. That's exactly what I wanted. So now we'll use some farms for you guys, which will be new for y'all to see here. Uh, me using farms. This is going to be a first, not a first time, I've used farms before, but I don't think I've really used them uh, in videos too much. So this will be good for you guys to see. It'll be fun. Um, so let's get here. And guys, you can see right now, see the red circle around there? If you want to be super precise, take your finger, click on the red circle, and move it over just barely instead of clicking on the tower. And that's how you can be really, really precise with your towers and your tower placement is by putting it down and then grabbing on the circle and you can adjust that. Somebody actually told me that in the comment section. And I was like, you're brilliant. Thank you. I don't remember when they told me that. It was a while ago, but it's little things like that that honestly help because if you're trying to go really later on in the game and uh, you want to last, you have to be really uh, aware of your tower placement so that you can fit enough. Like in my longest game with Nick, the one that I had 8,500 eco on, if you haven't seen that, check it out, it's on the channel. Um, I had to uh, I had to start deleting stuff and building like bigger upgrades because we couldn't fit it all, it was ridiculous. I seriously couldn't fit, uh, I couldn't fit everything. Let's go ahead, let's throw this down here and hopefully it'll bounce off of there. We'll go ahead and get more bananas on that as well. And we're gonna do some eco, so this is gonna be sweet. And guys, remember, if I was playing against somebody that I didn't know, I wouldn't get eco and farms, okay? Just because I, I couldn't trust them not to rush. But since Tone and I are playing as friends and we're trying to go late game, then I can do this. So if you guys are playing with your friends and y'all are both like, all right, dude, let's see how far we can go. This is it's perfect. It's a perfect, oh, he got farms too. Then it's a perfect time uh, to do that. So just know that the, the strategies that I'm playing right now are gonna be different than if I was facing somebody that I didn't know. Don't tell me I can't click on that down there. All right, good, I can. So if you're playing with your friends, do whatever the heck you want to. Sit next to each other, talk to each other, be like, hey man, let's, let's try and go, like we're not gonna try and beat each other, all right? Uh, that's one thing Nick and I always say. We're like, all right, we're not going to try and beat each other. We're going to try and let the game beat us. So that's always fun to do is letting the game beat you uh, and not each other. So I'm um, going to build up eco, going to build up farms, going to try and get a factory down there. And uh, now let's go ahead and get another. There we go. Right there. Perfect. And again, I was just touching on that red circle, scooting it over. It's a little bit easier on an iPad compared to if you're on like a, uh, a a phone or something like that, maybe a, a six plus it could work on, but on my six is a little bit hard to do it sometimes. So there we go, nice, nice, nice. And uh, we'll go ahead and uh, save up a little bit to upgrade this now because our subs are gonna do a perfectly fine job of holding off at this point. If you guys want a good tower that can hold off really, really well, the sub is great. It can go, look at this, I mean, we're round eight, I haven't had anything even get close to coming through. I don't even really need two subs right now. I just have it uh, to have, like I don't need it. But airburst darts are so clutch, especially on maps where it can cut through stuff. So you can see like right here is a, there's that little square at the top. So there's balloons all around it. They, they all just get wrecked by the, uh, by the subs airburst starts. So you can see right here, sending eco as well. And we're able to make so much more uh, because not only can we, uh, we can send more eco because we're getting more money from our plantation. Oh crap. I wasn't even thinking about uh, the fact that that's there. Let's throw this guy right. I'm going to let that one get through. I don't really mind. Um, we'll go ahead and build this. I wasn't paying attention there because I'm dumb. Let's go ahead and get advanced intel and that's going to help us out on that. 
and then we're going to there we go so we're, we're, we're building up a little bit I was, I was getting too excited about building eco there uh, and upgrading my farm and stuff that I totally forgot about that so we're gonna put this guy on strong so we can get some more lead build a little bit more eco round 14 and we already have almost 600 uh, eco it's not bad at all it's not bad at all and we're getting the eco from the farm as well so some of you guys might be a little bit confused when I say eco eco stands for economy and there's two types of economy in the game there's balloon economy which is money that you get from sending balloons. So you can see that green number at the bottom. Every time I send a balloon, it goes up. Um, you can also get economy from farms. That's farming economy. You can see every time I click on one of these bananas, it's uh, 60 cents or 60 cents, it's $60. Uh, so that's another type of economy that is in the game. We're gonna go ahead and get Flash Bomb rolling up here on this ninja. I'm making so much money right now, it's ridiculous. I can't believe that I already have my Flash Bomb, I already have this guy uh, to two, three, and already have the plantation upgraded as well. Um, but we are going to save up and continue just trying to get our eco up. I would like it to be at a thousand uh, balloon eco by round 24 at the latest, especially since I have this farm going. The farm's helping out a lot. No problem whatsoever. Go here, advanced intel, and uh, we'll leave that guy on first for now. But we're going to keep on getting that eco up. And then, I can't believe we got Super Monkey. I feel like this is going to be a good round. He got the Sniper. And if you guys had watched my video on going late game, the Sniper is a great late game tower because of it slowing down uh, the Moabs and the BFB. So on this map, they would just be stuck up there if you have a whole bunch of them. And uh, they would <laughs> it would just allow for all of your other towers to just completely dominate and, uh, and crush anything that comes into the screen. So here again, guys, I'm clicking on the red circle. Sometimes it'll jump back like that, uh, but we'll go ahead and get it right in range, right there, boom. And we're gonna go with a, um, a radioactive sub on this one. We'll go ahead and submerge it because we're gonna get it in just a second. You can see, oh, a reactor, I don't, why the heck am I saying radioactive? Come on, Mo. So, a reactor sub right there. And uh, we've got, I mean, we're doing good right now. It's round 20, I'm gonna go ahead and build one more over here. And we're just gonna place the other one as well since we're doing okay with time and money. Oh, come on! There it is, I was about to say, I know that I placed those correctly, don't tell me that I didn't. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get that, put that on strong as well. And now we're gonna get back to farming eco because we wanna have about a thousand just to keep us uh, holding off, just in case we like forget to click on bananas because sometimes when it gets crazy, super easy to forget to click on bananas. Where did his other towers go? He's going all wizards right now or all monkey apprentices? I don't know, okay, there's a sniper right there. I don't know how late how late he's gonna be able to go, honestly, with uh, rolling with that. So that could uh, that could up being a little bit dangerous. We'll go left on this guy as well. And uh, I, just, I just tried to go to submerge, even though he didn't have submerge and support. So we'll put him down on submerge right there. Look at all this ego that we're getting down here. That's what I'm talking about. And we'll go ahead in just a couple seconds, upgrade this to reactor, not radioactive. I don't know what my deal was with that. And we're gonna keep on farming. So our subs are doing a great job for us right now, especially since they have advanced intel on them and they're able to see the camo that the ninja monkey is seeing as well. Um, so he's upgraded uh, his wizards fairly well. I'm a little bit worried. I want him to have more eco and I haven't seen him sin too much uh, on my side. So uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll see what happens over there. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and build uh, I don't want to build another farm. I'm just going to upgrade this one right here. And let's go ahead and get some more ninjas up in here. We'll do balloon jitsu. Actually, no. I want to get a uh, sabotage supply line right there. Perfect. One of my favorite uh, balloon control things. Some people were being so dumb in the comments of my last video. Like, most well, just making a BC to sound cool. No, I'm making it up so that it's easier to talk about. Instead of saying balloon control, balloon control, balloon control. Every time that I say it, you guys will understand. And I guess that the people that were making fun of it weren't paying attention, uh, which would make sense because generally they're too focused on uh, their thoughts and, and how cool they are. But um, I was saying that because balloon control, controlling the balloons. Y'all were saying something about tower damage and stuff. No, I was talking about stopping balloons pushing them back, uh, stunning them, all that kind of stuff is balloon control, controlling the balloon. So, if you were one of those people, you might want to get your facts straight because you embarrass yourself. Um, we're going to go ahead and put down uh, some super monkeys over here on the side. They're going to be clutch over here. Laser blast, put him on strong. I'm a little bit worried. I'm actually very worried for tone right now 
Um, it didn't look like he played a lot of games before. Um, and so, again, like I said, a little bit worried. We'll go ahead and get a Banana Republic over here. And our eco is blowing right now. It's absolutely killing it. I wouldn't mind getting this on the right side. Each bunch of your box bananas worth 50% more. That's so good. 50% more is ridiculous. Um, we're holding off really well right now. We've got the flash bomb going off. We're about to see our first Moab coming in. And, oh gosh, Tone. Tone! Tone is about to go down to the rainbow regions. And I don't know how he's going to do with damage against Moab at this point. So, again, a little bit worried about that. Let's go ahead and get that uh, a 3-2 right now. And then 14,000 for the factory is going to be clutch. We'll get Plasma Blast. And let's keep on going here. We're going to keep on farming. Again, I'm not too worried about uh, my damage here. We'll go. I'm not going to use Sabotage Supply Line yet because I think we'll be fine without it. And we will. Tone, I'm a little bit worried about over there. Um, but let's go ahead and actually get one more Sabotage Supply Line just to help us out whenever that one that we have currently runs out. There we go. So it's good to have like two to four of those um, because they help out a whole bunch. So we'll go ahead and get another Sabotage Supply Line in about two seconds. One and two. Nope. Yep, there it is. <laughs> and get some more bananas down here. And, uh, oh, I didn't mean to hit that. Dang it. Why the heck did I do that? That's one problem with building up there at the top of the screen is totally just messing up and hitting your balloon energy. Uh, it's bad. It can, it can get pretty bad. So, oh my gosh, we've got so much going on down here. All of those are worth 90 now because it added an extra 30 from that original 60. I'm worried for Tone right now. All he's got is these snipers and uh, these Moabs are coming down to the wire. He need, where I don't even know what his other thing is. He had to sell his farm. Um, so guys, in the future, if you are a fan, um, make sure you know how to go late game, okay? Because I want the games with you guys to last a while. Round 30 is not that late. I feel like Tone's probably going to get overrun in the next five rounds or so. Um, so make sure that you know how to go late game, you know what I'm talking about, etc., etc., because that's going to make it uh, a lot more fun for both of us. There go a whole bunch of balloons uh, on his side, but he was able to boost right at that last minute. All these tornadoes. Oh, worried about that. Yep, definitely worried about his side right now. We'll go ahead and use one of our Sabotage Supply Lines. And uh, we're going to save up and just get a freaking Sun God over here because that's going to be epic for us. Uh, we're going to get that in just a couple seconds. Again, Tone trying his best to hold off the Moabs. But Wizards don't have that good of popping power against Moabs. One of them coming around the final corner. Is he going to hold it off? No, they're going to make it through. All right, lag. So they made it through, but not uh, on his screen. So uh, that's what's up. <laughs> but we're doing okay. We're holding off, guys. And with these, with these, uh, yeah, there it goes. So he just lost right there. Tone, good job, my dude. It was fun playing with you. Uh, we'll try and do this more often, guys. Maybe during streams and stuff like that. We'll, uh, I'll play with fans. But hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, whenever we play together, we're going to go late game. We're going to have fun. That's what I want to do. Some of you guys, we can try and get to like round 60 or 70 or something. It'd be epic. But if you guys enjoyed and if y'all are stoked about this, leave a like on the video. Share it with your friends. Let them know most playing BDD with its fans. Love you guys. As always, make sure you keep calm and you pop on. All right? See you guys later. Peace.